Outlaw, Macho, Drive In. WrestleMania, a streak was broken, and that is John Cena did not win. He lost. <laughs> he didn't win two in a row. Yeah. Not this time. Take take a seat. Take him to the seat at the back. We're having this one. <laughs> so that was good. I, that's, I think that's why I enjoyed this one. It was nice to see CM Punk winning Summer, finally getting behind him. Taker and Edge, fantastic match. But yeah, John Cena lost. I was happy about that. I, I just, the I just world didn't like is a better it. place. <laughs> exactly. It was, you know, this time, this time in period. I think a lot of people dislike Cena because he was just everything Cena wanted, and I was, you know, just the fact that it was, he was on a WrestleMania card for a title and he lost. So that's yeah. a good discussion, Joe. We should have in the future. Everybody's love and hatefulness of John Cena. Because I love him. Yeah. I get yeah. it. But yeah. Yeah. Back yeah. yeah. then I hated him. But yeah. now he's gone. I miss him. I do miss him. <laughs> so, he's a lesson more guy. You never you, yeah. you never appreciate something until it's truly gone. Or you never do exactly. no, no, no. until it's gone. Or you know. There's no, 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 no. gone in there, so you just yeah. No, no, no. I, I, he, are you no. See, here's the thing. Are you disagreeing or are you saying no, you don't really appreciate it? Just... I, I, I disagree. I, I appreciate part time John Cena. I don't miss full time John Cena. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Here like, and there, like do a couple of things. Yes, yes. But him he's... every day doing his thing, defeating tag teams, beating 10 people at the same time. Yeah, I don't uh, see that. <laughs> he's, um, when he was the US champ and he done that weekly open challenge thing, I thought that was that was like his peak at the, towards the end of his career. That was really good. Yeah. You know, when they put that title in, I mm-hmm. thought, oh, fucking hell, not again. But you know, I'll, I'll give him props. That was that was good. I enjoyed Raw. Great that run day. with it. it. Wasn't too bad. I yeah. enjoyed watching yeah. Raw. <laughs> so did you get yeah. a surprise of the week? I like yeah. Kevin Owens, Sammy, Sammy yeah. Zane. It was good. It was a good way to just pop people up. Yeah. Yeah. That's, and I there was all good matches as well. Yeah. So. I could, I couldn't complain. Yeah. Um, yeah. I didn't dislike so, Cena until 2010 when he beat uh, Batista three times in a row. That's when I started, like, you know. Coming. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, really. I was, I'm only laughing about him because he. No, 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 I agree with you. It's just funny because he did that with everybody. <laughs> he did that with Russo. <laughs> he did that with Bray Wyatt. Yeah, just... exactly. After this <laughs> one. So this one, this one was the kicker. Like, yeah. 2010 was like the year that, you know, like it was all about like, screw you, Cena's winning. So Batista three times, mm-hmm. Nexus, Nexus in the first match they had, like he was down there against two of them and then he beat them and we inside a minute. <laughs> and... <laughs> It's definitely a lot of hate for Cena, yeah, for yeah. sure. And you know, like I say, now he's gonna do miss him a little bit. Just a little and, bit. The part time scene last, gets full time now. Yeah, and one last thing was Cena, but I did shit. I had a tear in my eye when Brock Lesnar destroys John Cena and told all them kids Santa Claus isn't real. It was beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> he, he killed your hero. <laughs> it, it, it should have happened uh, like at their first match. Like I was always like one guy told me before. Whenever I think about like Brock Lesnar's first match back versus Cena, where Cena just you know gets the hell beaten out of him and just pins Lesnar after an FU or an attitude adjustment at that time. Uh, mm-hmm. It's like this yeah. one said. Like whenever I remember this match, uh, I think about that scene from The Dark Knight where Joker just. You know, lights up this huge stack of of, of cash on fire because you you kind of buried Lesnar. But go go ahead, Pete. We just, yeah. we just had to talk about our love and hate of John Cena. Yes. <laughs> now that, that that was my final point. I'm just yeah. saying, I, I miss him. I miss the part time, like you say, James. The full time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You yeah. Can, you know, we can we can leave that. We can leave that. Yeah. Thank you for joining us in the Outlaw Macho Driving. If you liked that video, please click like and subscribe to our channel for more content from The Dragon. For full episodes of our podcast, please look us up on Anchor or Spotify. Just search for Outlaw Macho Dragon, or click the link in the description below. Please uh, feel free to comment, tell us what you think about our discussion, please tell us what you think about us, tell us what you think in general. The world's your oyster. And do us a favor, spread the word, help us out here, share. Thank you, we love you.
Bye.